T90MS is an export version of T90M, which is a modernized version of T90 main battle tank built by your Alvagonzovat. The tank is being proposed for the Russian army and potential export customers. T90MS was first demonstrated during the Russian Expo Arms in September 2011. On contrary VT4 is an export version of MBT-3000, designed and manufactured by Norinco. MBT-3000 was unveiled for the first time to the public at the International Defense Exhibition Eurosat Ori in June 2012, one year after T90MS was revealed. Since both tanks are developed in the same period and are export variants, a comparison is logical. Both tanks are competing with each other in the international market, along with T-84 Oplet from Ukraine, but Kiev's inability to complete the orders demerits the Oplet. In this video, we will analyze both MBTs in the domain of firepower, protection, and mobility. Design-wise both tanks have a similar layout with driver position at the front center of hull, commander and gunner in the turret, having low profile design. Both tanks feature an all-welded turret design, protected by the explosive reactive armor. ERA package on T90MS is new relict reactive armor on the front of the hull and turret, which provides protection against heat, APFSDS, and tandem shape warheads. While on current variants of VT4, FY2 and FY4 ERA tiles are installed. There is a false perception that the front of the turret is covered with wedge-shaped applique armor, which acts as space armor over composite armor. The actual turret armor consists of an external layer of thinner FY2 explosive reactive armor that is installed on top of a high-hardness steel plate covering NARA modules. FY4 on hull front like Relict also provides protection against heat, APFSDS, and tandem warhead ammunition. Although both tanks have a decent amount of ERA tiles on frontal arc, ERA coverage on T90MS is more than that of VT4. On T90MS tank rear hull and turret are fitted with slat armor to protect the engine section and ammunition compartment from grenade and rocket attacks. While on VT4 bar slat armor is only provided on turret sides and back. Passive protection of T90MS is one step ahead of VT4. There is also an option of GL5 hard kill active protection system on VT4 tank. The firepower of both tanks is similar, these are armed with 125mm smoothbore guns. T90MS uses 2A46M5 gun, while main gun on VT4 is ZPT98 which is an improved version of 2A46M. The ammunition load of T90MS tank is 40 rounds, while the VT4 can carry 38 rounds of main ammunition, with a maximum loading speed of 8 rounds per minute, with 22 rounds on the auto loader, remaining 16 shells are inside the vehicle. T90MS has also 22 shells in its magazine, and 8 rounds in the external turret bustle, and only 10 shells are stored inside the tank. There is no turret bustle available on VT4, in case of T90MS there are low risks of explosion and high chances of crew survivability. Both tanks are equipped with coaxial 7.62mm machine gun. The remote weapon station on T90MS is armed with 7.62mm machine gun, while on VT4 there is a 12.7mm heavy machine gun. The fire control system on T90MS is new Kalina FCS, which incorporates the multi-channel main gunner's sight, consisting of sighting and thermal channels, laser range finder, and inbuilt laser control channel. FCS of VT4 is also digital and has hunter-killer capability, laser range finder, panoramic sight, and a third-generation thermal imaging system. Both tanks are augmented with a digital ballistic computer featuring weather and topographical transmitting units, and a barrel straightness monitor. VT4 tank is powered by turbocharged electronic control diesel engine developing 1300 horsepower, with a combat weight of 52 tons it has power to weight ratio of 25 horsepower per ton. Even VT4 shipped to Pakistan army have 1500 horsepower engine. On contrary T90MS is motorized with a new V92S2F turbocharged diesel engine, developing 1130 horsepower. 
T90MS is around 4 tons lighter than its Chinese counterpart, with a weight of around 48 tons it has power to weight ratio of 23.5 horsepower per ton. MS can accomplish a speed of 60 km per hour and a range of 550 km, while VT4 has a maximum speed of 70 km per hour and cruising range of 500 km. Mobility Vise VT4 is superior to T90 MS with higher power to weight ratio and speed. Unit cost of T90 MS is 4.5 million US dollar in 2016, while VT4 cost around 3 million dollars in 2014. Three VT4 tanks can be acquired from China at same price of two T90 MS tanks. In the end, although T90 MS has superior protection, but with equivalent firepower, greater mobility and low cost makes VT4 attractive option in the international market. Both tanks benefits from the latest technology for main battle tanks and are specially designed to meet the challenge of high-tech warfare. Their overall performance and combat capability put these tank among the most advanced ones in the world.